Howdy folks, Josh here with The Weekend Angler. Out here at the Ohio River, been doing some bank fishing today. It's right here at the end of 2020. But the fish that you're gonna see in this video, not all of them came from the Ohio River. And stick around, you're gonna find out how. Alright guys, like I said, not all the fish in this video came from the Ohio River. A lot of them did, but not all of them. Now, uh, as I've progressed through the year, and uh, gone fishing here, gone fishing there, uh, every once in a while you just end up with a trip that might have one or two fish in it, and you just really can't find a way to turn that into a video that somebody will enjoy. Well, the end result of that is you get to the end of the year and you have a ton of stuff on your hard drive with fish being caught that you never did anything with. And uh, historically, usually I just delete those guys or use them for, uh, for B-roll. But uh, I decided this year, why don't we do something just a little bit different? These are all the fish from 2020 that you guys did not see on my channel. So let's go ahead and get it started. We're gonna be uh, up there the first part of the year. I'll put the date and the uh, location on all these fish and show you where they're at. We'll go from there. This is rip and drag, man. Yeah, but remember now. I know there's a bunch of current. I'm trying to keep, I'm, I'm gonna go this side of the boat. Yeah, uh, hold on. All right. All right, calm it down, guys. We've been out here. Um, Hello, Driftwood. Oh, yeah, I'm tangled up good. Yeah, it's just twisted in there a couple times. Maybe. There we go. This is our first uh, Ohio River Blue Cat of uh, 2020. 7.5. Seven and a half pound Ohio River blue cat. So let's get this thing out back in the water. We gotta get our lines uh, untangled afterwards. Another bow fin. Good old toothy creature. Prehistoric fish. And that's what's been up here eating the shed. Bow fin. Probably six or seven pounds. I don't know. He scored first. Well, well, I'm getting the net. Uh, you got a chimp kit? Oh, the big old drum. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Heath's been wanting to eat one of these things. I ain't eating that thing. He swallowed it. Uh, probably. How many pounds is he? Five. Yeah, he called it good. Five. Six point seven. Yeah. It's not too bad. No. 
Yep. All right, buddy. I'll treat you. Ohio River. Easter Saturday. I thought for sure he was going in that bag. Listen. No kidding. No, no. Is he? Yeah. Ooh. Another drunk? Uh, I'm not going to say. You want to run over? I Here, we hold it. Oh, yeah. Look, I got two cameras. Oh. Come on, you. I need the net, so I'm oh, going to. Give me just a second. I don't think we're going to need a net. Okay. Josh says we don't need a net, so I'm double filming. Oh, gosh. Uh, probably just made people drunk. There we go. Hey, we're getting barge bite. That's what we're getting. Barge bite, yeah. Finally got a barge bite. I think we might be I into it. Yeah. I think we might be into a nest of channel cat. Josh says he doesn't need a net, so we'll see. We'll see. Uh, what about a ten-pound blue, maybe? Do you need the net? All right. Oh, he's about, he's about five, or, five six. or six. That's a, that's on that big piece of bait too. Yeah, that's he's a got belly full of it. Yeah, she's a pretty good fish. Pretty blue cat. Yeah. Talking, Talking to, to you. Wants to yeah. everybody hi. She said, she said subscribe, so you got to subscribe. <laughs> There we go, guys. We've been trying all day. Been getting frustrated. Heath was bringing his uh, Heath was bringing his rod in, and I thought, well, I said maybe they got tied together, you know. And uh, I said, are they, we're not on top of each other, are we? He said, no. I said, well, I got a fish. Reeled down, you know, nice solid four pound, four or five pound uh, blue cat out of the parking lot of the boat ramp and off of the rod holder on the boat. So uh, our crazy fishing method today uh, has paid off. Maybe they're going to start biting now. I don't know. But he, he ate a uh, fillet of a, yeah. He ate fillet of gizzard shad. Come up and say hi. Yep. You ready to go back in the water? Yeah. You got friends down there? We don't want to say.
All right, guys. Not bad for the first one of the day. I've been out here about 10 minutes. And this guy here, nice, healthy Ohio River blue cat, swallowed up a uh, shad or a uh, fillet of a gizzard shad. Almost took the rod in the water. I wasn't paying attention, but uh, had to drag a little too tight, I think. But we're going to get him back in the water. Nice, healthy, probably, I don't know, 10, 10 pound fish or so. Heath is hooked into what feels like a pretty solid cat. We're just doing drag. Heath was actually retying. Broke off pretty quick. Yeah, he's not very big. He ain't big? No, he ain't big. A very yeah, pretty late channel cat. Dragon cat. Go 20 feet over flood stage. That one's mine, isn't it? I don't think it's a draw. And there we go. We so guys, we whoa, hey, he pulled a little bit of drag. Well, quite a bit actually. Huh? I said he's pulling quite a bit actually. Hey, that's a oh, it's a big old drum. Is it really? Yeah, look at that. Right Hold on. He's pulling some drag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that is a big old drum. That's a pretty good sized drum. Look at that. That didn't take long. No. Oh, uh. Oh. Down, huh? Got him? Hey, Heath, that one's got a bite. <laughs> All right, guys, it's getting frantic right here. This is a drum. It's a freshwater drum. It's not what we're after today. We're going to let him go because we're starting to get bites. Um. All right, guys, fish number two. Uh, it's on Heath's rod. Heath's reeling it in, but I hooked him. Oh, it's a little, hey, a little channel, channel cat. cat. Ah, you don't need that, Dad. Oh. Uh, tiny, tiny, tiny. This is that lay down tree, so guys, we'll keep an eye on that. We didn't even have barely all the lines out. We're already getting bite. So. Oh, oh, that's mine, isn't it? Is it felt like a good fish. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, it's pulling drag. Oh, it's running to the boat. Another drum? That might be. Let's see what we got. Don't get in that bag. Come on, don't get in the bag. Not you, the fish. Oh, what do we got here? Whatever it is, is better. Oh, oh. oh, a big old channel cat. Is that a channel? Ah, uh, one of the two. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty good sized fish. The biggest channel cat I've ever caught is 15, right? Or was yeah, it 13? 15, I believe. So. Get in there. All right. Okay. All right, let him go. 9.3. Really? Yep. He looks way bigger than he that. He looks bigger than that. Not a bad fish, though. No, that's a pretty good channel cat. And uh, he's under 10. Yeah. Up to you whether we keep him or not as your fish. No, I'm putting him back. That's okay. a bigger channel cat. Channel cat got that big in the Ohio River. Like yeah. You know, he deserves to live. He gets to go. That thing throttled up, and as soon as it throttled up, he bit. Ah, 
think it's another. Another gar. Big old chunk of cat, I think. Bird fight. We're not getting skunked up here, but uh, we're actually getting ready to move. It's been a while since we've had a bite, and it wasn't a gar. so it doesn't turn it's, on you. Oh. There going. he is. There he is. Keep going. You almost got him. And he's going to get the net. Oh, Caitlin no, scored first on the... Oh, man. Caitlin, you did it. You broke in your new rod, girly friend. Give it another another crank. Look at that one you caught, baby. Whoa. Oh, whoa. Oh. <laughs> I'm definitely going to name him Splasher. Uh -huh, All right, push that button on that reel. There we go. Oh, Caitlin, good, good job. I, I won. You won. You man. won. That was the slime cat challenge. Caitlin, you caught the first fish on our slime cat rods. What do you think of it? I like it. Yep. Right. Not a bad fish. Get up there and get close to that. Eight pounds even, Caitlin. All right. Good job, Lucy. Good job. Oh, and he's heavy. Like I said, we got a mixture right now of white bass and fresh skipjack. All of them pretty well running the same rig, single 10 op. Oh. Oh, All right, here first one of the day, boys. Feels good. You get that other. Uh, he ain't that big. He just felt good. First fight, guys, was uh, getting the grippers on him. But uh, there he is, nice little blue cat. We'll let him go. First one of the day, though. There he goes. Back down to the bottom. Look at that. Huh. <laughs> Little one. Come here, little guy. Oh! <laughs> Alright guys, we ain't gone much further. And we got fish number two, pretty little uh, wide-mouthed blue cat. He's saying hello, guys. So uh, let's let him go. And we'll rebate. But that's two in not very long time. So hopefully we got more over here. 40 foot of water. That's the name of the game. It's been the name of the game the past couple times I've been out. Find 40 feet of water, you'll find some fish.
pumping rods out of the water. Let's see this puppy. Feels okay. It's not huge. Ah, nice little fish. Six, thirty-seven feet of water, guys, and actually I was bumping whenever that one hit. So Let's see if this old guy go. See you, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. Right, he didn't he wasn't much for saying goodbyes, was he? Barge right, he stopped. a little one. This one don't feel that big at all, guys. Little cat. A little bit of pull to him. Oh, he's wrapped up. untangled himself probably made that uh, thing a tangled mess I'll never get out of that cut but, uh, cat number two not horrible little cat kind of pain in the neck all right let's let cat number two go see you buddy thanks for tangling everything I really appreciate that Oh Lord, it's times like this I wish I had a few more rods already rigged up. So I'm going to be a bit getting that thing taken care of. I think we're about done drifting. I think we're done drifting for the year guys. There's some fish stacked up.
That feels pretty good. Guys, he's coming out of that 60 feet of water. Well, he's not bad. He's rolled up in it. Never saw him blow his boat. I don't know if he's going to... There he goes. <laughs> Alright guys. Healthy little blue cat. He hit hard. Hit like a ton of bricks. But, uh, come out about 60 feet of water. He burped pretty good when I got him up here. And we're going over another fish, so we're going to let you go, buddy. Take it. Looky here, guys. He was hooked. A big old dink cat. <laughs> I went to reel that in. Yeah, I hear you. Went to reel that in. Just an old dink channel cat. Kind of that olive color, but uh, he probably the more than likely gonna be the last fish of the year. Little bitty guy like that. All right, guys. Well, that moon rising up there over my shoulder means it's time for me to uh, get everything packed up and head back to the house. Appreciate you sticking with me on this video. You just saw what's more than likely going to be the last fish of 2020. But uh, you know what, guys? I'm ready to. Uh, move on into 2021 i think it's gonna be a lot better year anyway but uh this video like i said this was a uh, compilation of all the fish you did not see during the year just stuff that uh a fish here a fish there that just couldn't quite find a way to make a video out of but uh hey you know what uh turned it into something you guys at least you know hey we all got to watch some fish being caught so Guys, appreciate you sticking with me on this one. Uh, if you enjoyed this one, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, maybe take a moment to subscribe. And guys, until next time, we'll catch you out on the water. Appreciate you watching the Weekend Angler.